basically what we did is it was very important for us this season to do color and we were really trying to figure out a new way of doing color and again the association with color is really great color means energy it's positive and i think in this economy you really need to drive sales and you need to make sure that people coming in you know looking for something different and color really reacts to different people different way you know red is energy so anytime people wearing red they feel beautiful actually i know some people who are just addicted to red it's very interesting so color was very important for us and so then we try to see and juxtapose um, you know, color with different colors and really play around. Um, and then we were really inspired by the 90s and street dancing, break dancing actually. And so we started looking at the track suits that they were wearing. You know, they were pretty fabulous, I have to say. And so we kind of um, took that idea with all the lines and shapes, and that's why you saw the jackets over the elegant uh, dresses. And then we kind of started thinking, you know, what were they dancing to? What, what was the mood? And then there was this whole tribal thing, and we're like, oh my god, this is perfect. And of course, we happen to have a tribal friend around. Um, but what we did, the great thing is infused it with bright color. So uh, in terms of shapes, it was very important. You know, BCBG, um, what it stands for is good style, good attitude. So it's really, um, we focus on making a woman feel and look beautiful. Period. So I will not do any funky shapes or anything like that because we ourselves wear the clothes and I like to always feel beautiful in everything that I wear so the shapes are very easy, they're flowing, they're, if you look at the colors they're very slimming, they're in the right areas <laughs> um, and it's, it's exciting, you know. Yeah, there are certain fashion things that will never go out of style like 70s because polyester doesn't disintegrate. In areas, <laughs> your variant, in 20 years it looks exactly the same. And so the teenagers oh, yes. will always dress in 70s, in 80s. I mean, we have five daughters. Marina is here. Wow. Hi. And so they're always wearing the trends that we actually wore in the high school. I'm like, really? That's still in? <laughs> I'm against bell bottoms. No, 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 no. And I'm like, God, that's really good. And proud. They're sexy then. Yeah, you know exactly. Right? That. You're like, really? <laughs> I've chosen it, we have to go home and uh, put that in working process. No, you have another show, right? Yeah, no, after the show. After the show. So what we have is, uh, we're very excited, on Tuesday we have Harvey Leger, which is our pride and joy. And um, I don't know if you guys know a lot, some of you I'm sure know Harvey Leger. I think there's but, a Leger dress going on in the uh, right now. Mm. So Harvey Leger is, is a brand um, that we've been um, nurturing <laughs> for a little while, but just to let, give you a little bit, rejuvenate. it takes, reju yeah, rejuvenated, uh, but it takes about six weeks to make, to make one dress, and it's really a uh, labor of art, it's all done by hand, and uh, it's, there's no pattern for Harvey Leger because it's one continuous band. And so to do the show is really a miracle most of the time because we literally go like this. <laughs> like, is it coming? It's like giving birth, you know, pretty much so. And it's, it's, a very, it's a very interesting process. It's very different than cotton and sew. And uh, it's, it's beautiful, you know. And so we're very excited. It's, the collection is actually coming tomorrow, so I'm very excited to see it again <laughs> after alteration has been done. And uh, it's going to be amazing. what it is, I think that a max out, everybody's confused because I don't know if you haven't noticed, but everything has Max Azria on it. So it's BCBG Max Azria, BCBG Max Azria runway, Max Azria, Harvey Leisure by Max Azria. And I think <laughs> everybody starts getting confused, you know what I'm saying, with Max Azria, Max Azria, Max Azria, Max Azria. So it was, we just wanted to like refocus and really combine the Max Azria line and BCBG runway into one line because it was just getting a little bit too much. Also the distribution on it, it's like, do you put it here, do you put it here? So it became very, you know, and I complex. was, it's just complex. And Max Hazria started, um, I don't know if any of you are familiar with the line, but it actually started because it was a gift from my husband to me for my birthday, because I wanted to make something that was different. Um, it was really PMS, but, uh, <laughs> so we ended up doing that for about four years, and it was great, but I really, the idea of combining it, you know, because it did cross over the lines. There were a lot of similarities, and why do you produce the same thing where you can say it in one line, in one place? But it, it was fun. Uh, 
but she's less small. Well, she wants to be like. That's our good point. I like work. I like work. So we. My son, my son uh, evolve every week, every day, every month. Uh, I go uh, with the mood and uh, the weather, the feeling. Sometimes you see me always in a suit, sometimes always in t shirt sometimes not in skirt. But, uh, <laughs> and some fashions night out, t-shirt yeah. today. Yeah, I, I can say that I have probably uh, 35 look a year. <laughs> Change so all the time. Oh, he does. <laughs> Thank you. And what about you, Lou Bob? Well, I think style is, is about attitude. Do you know what I'm saying? When I feel good, oh my God, do I look good. Um, and then when I don't feel good, I don't look good. But in terms of um, style, I think it's a personal innate type of thing. You know, I'm Ukrainian originally, so I will always do the babushka embroidery. <laughs> I will always look for a perfect tunic. <laughs> I will always wear a certain boot. It's just something that innate that comes, you know, I can't help it. And by the way, every collection you'll see, you'll see the same thing, because I tend to do, <laughs> you know. Um, but in terms of personal style, you know, like Max said, we evolve we change all the time you know I love beautiful things um, I'm not the person that likes very simple things I think life should be booked and celebrated and you should make a statement every time you can um, you know and I think you should have fun with clothes I think the moment you take clothes too seriously forget it you know really you have one life to live how are you gonna live and I imagine literally my customers and everybody that I work with I imagine them I would dress half of the people I'm like mm, that's how I could happen <laughs> um, but really, I, I really feel that everybody should just have fun. Exactly. You know, there's no rules. There's just really to be no, fair. Yeah. no rules. No you rules. here first. <laughs> yeah. I mean, look at, look at the runway. You know, they were wearing what the girls were wearing, very kind of modern, cool dresses, asymmetrical ham, with ethnic sandal, with very 70s clutch. I mean, you know, and their hair looked like they just came out of the shower. Love and who said that that's right? <laughs> yeah.